And as the world marked the 2021 International Women's Day, issues around non-equal pay and sexual harassment of female athletes have again been brought to the fore as a major setback in empowering women through sports. It is special report to the sports correspondent Emmanuel Akindabua takes a look at these concerns whilst celebrating Nigeria's sports and Amazons over the past few decades. And here she goes. This moment, 25 years ago at the Atlanta 1996 Summer Olympic Games, brought Nigeria a first ever Olympic gold medal. The name of the athlete was Chioma Ajunwa. Oh my goodness, it's 7 12. It's a new African and Commonwealth record for the Nigerian. That is going to be very, very tough to beat. To God be the glory. I was very, very happy when it was done on me that the jump was given. Beyond its enormous human and natural resources, Nigeria is famously known around the world for our historic sporting achievements, which in most cases are achieved by women. Nigeria's Super Falcons have dominated African women's football for the past three decades, winning 10 championships and playing at seven FIFA World Cup tournaments. Despite this illustrious achievement of women in Nigerian sports, there are numerous recurring challenges they are made to face. Some will tell you uh, uh, their coaches, uh, their coaches just will be shouting on them. They are, uh, they can't do this. Those are verbal abuse, harassment. Mothers don't encourage their daughters to come out to do sport because they don't want their children to be harassed. They don't want people to mess around with the, with their girls. The issues facing women in Nigerian sports extends beyond those actively participating as athletes. Female sport journalists, writers and officials have equally expressed sadness about the numerous gender-based challenges they are forced to deal with. Gender inequality won. You know, the men are being recognized more than the women um, in the sporting world. This year is the 25th year that we got only one gold medal in the Olympics. And ever since then, we've been attending the Olympics, couldn't even get any. To address that in, internally, there should be more female coaches. With iconic names like Messi Akide Udo, Perpetua Nkwocha, Farilat Ogunkoya, Mary Onyali Omagbemi, Blessing Okagbari, Funke Oshunaike, Odwayo Adekoroye, Asizat Oshola and many others. How well should Nigeria be treating as sporting Amazons? And imagine if it were to be our senior teams, national the Super Eagles, that is doing so well, especially in Africa, you know. I'm sure a lot of oil companies, telecommunication will pour millions of them. You know, we need to encourage our girls. The team for this year's International Women's Day is Choose to Challenge. The focus is aimed at supporting women to make significant changes by excelling in their chosen field. It is hoped that Nigeria will continue to support and empower women involved in sports as they strive to bring the country joy and pride. Emmanuel Akindubua, TVC News, Lagos.